hi guys welcome back to my channel so today i'll be showing you how i prepare escovitch and brown stew so i went ahead and prepped my fish um now i'm frying it in some really hot oil and you can use any season that you want i also put um garlic just for flavor in the oil and i'm doing this outside on my patio this is what it looks like when you fry it on one side and here I am turning it over and we're going to repeat that process to any amount of fish that you have. So we're going to take it inside when we're finished and we're going to do the vegetable that will go on top. It was so much fun cooking outside. Reminds me of that I was if I when I was in summer. Yay! So guys, for the escovitch, we're gonna get uh, some vinegar. I'm gonna say this is maybe half cup of vinegar. Pull it like sabu. Oh, half cup of vinegar in that. Yeah. And then we already went ahead and did um carrot strips so we're gonna, we're gonna put and we did onion rings and we're gonna use some sweet pepper bell pepper so first we're gonna put in our carrots okay so we're just gonna give that a little stir so we're gonna allow this just to blanch a little bit in the vinegar water So we're going to use maybe a tablespoon of white sugar just to get some of the vinegar out of it. Vinegar, um, so the taste tastes too much like vinegar. And we're going to allow this to sit a little. And then in the meantime, we're doing um, the brown stew fish. So guys, basically what I add to make this um, sauce is um, ketchup and barbecue. And so I let, and I put carrots in it to cook. So meanwhile, I let's bring it to a boil. After that, I put, I merge the fish in. And then I put some bell pepper and onion. So I'm just going to let these cook a little. So what I'm doing is kind of basing, basing the top of it like so. And this is all this this is actually ready because the fish we, we already did the fish so this is actually ready can turn it off and just look at that guy just look at that bone stew smell amazing look at that wow look at that wow I miss a yummy 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 so this is what we're looking for. We're just gonna let the carrot cook a little. So what I'm gonna do is um, I'm gonna merge in some um, bell pepper just to give it, you know, color. And guys, you can put in pepper, but we won't do the, the lot of pepper. I'm gonna actually use some pepper flake. Just a little pe pepper flake in it. Because I won't use this scotch bonnet pepper because it's going to be too hot for my family. I'm going to use just that. And I think this is it. So, we're going to go ahead and put in our onion. I'm going to put it in just to let it cook yourself well not really cook but you know blanch a little this is what we're looking for so we're gonna cover this we're gonna cover it for a minute and a half okay so this is ready Ooh, look at that. This is ready. 
turn off our stove and then we're gonna put over on it now look at this guys we're just gonna put it right over and guys I'm using a, a tongue using a tongue to do it and then what I'm gonna do is this juice that is here there's a little bit of a juice I'm just gonna do like so just to kind of base it over on for it to for the vinegar to just soak in look at that I'm not gonna use all of it and take a look at that guys take a look at that look at that is amazing yeah so we're gonna cover this and serve that later